Say she love me, we finna see a low VE. Like what that mean, we finna see. We finna see if she my kind, I'm tryna see. And I hope I ain't wasting my time. She so fine, she a quarter, no dime. She so fine, a quarter, no dime. No dime. Catch a nigga slipping at the light. Slide, she don't mind it in your life. Oh, and she mine. Hit her from behind all the time. Hit her from behind, break her spine. She a stick a bitch up like a porcupine. If I get her the clock, she go ahead and walk. Walk in that spot, we got all eyes. All the ice on freeze up. I got trust issues, I never believe her. I tell the channel vlog, channel vlog, channel my boy. Oh, my boy, he with me. My boy, he with me. Let him know what's going on. Hey man, he's currently editing a video for my main channel. Now most people do not know, I have two editors. I have a main channel editor and a vlog channel editor. Now recently, this is starting to help me because I'm able to push out my videos faster for my vlog channel. Before, I just had one editor for the both of my channels. Everybody is different. Some people edit their own videos. Some people got editors. Whatever it takes for you to get there, you need to do it. You know what I mean? But right now, he cooking. He cooking up. And I've been telling him as a recently, I feel like, in the YouTuber's world and shit like that, I feel like people don't show enough of credit and enough respect to their editors. I feel like in the rapper's world, producers are just the same as editors to YouTubers. And I feel like producers get way more knowledge in the rap world. You feel me? Even though they still get a little bit, they still need more, but they're just starting to get their notoriety. And I feel like we need to change the narrative for like YouTubers and shit. I feel like certain people and certain editors should be associated with, you know what I'm saying, certain YouTubers behind the scenes and closed doors. And you know, it's the YouTube world, small as hell. Everybody know everybody. And if you get real deep into it and you figure it out, Certain editors are associated with certain YouTubers and people. So when you hear an editor name and ring a bell, but oh, he worked with Woot the Woot. Oh, that editor, oh, no, I know him from Woot the Woot. I used to work with him back in the day. He worked with Woot the Woot now. Oh, yeah, he came up with them. But me, I'm trying to be different. I want my editors on hand, like right here, pull up on me. Both of my editors, they both live in Atlanta. That shit has been hard to find because in the past, my editors always live in other states. So they're super accessible when they're right here with me. And I always say, I don't know if y'all watch my Instagram story, but I always like kind of compare it to Gunna. Cause Gunna, I don't know if y'all know, Gunna has three different producers. He has Turbo, Wheezy, and Taurus. Turbo, Wheezy, and Taurus, they be with Gunna damn near wherever he go. If he across the country in Cancun, Jamaica, they right there, they will set up shop and make some beats and be like, hey, come lock in. And I feel like that's what I wanna start doing. When I go city to city or I go country to country, wherever I do, I wanna bring my editors with me. So when I'm out there getting that content and doing this and doing that, boom, they can set up a shot right there and edit on the spot. You feel me? And not only that, I feel like when your editors know how you think and how you speak and how you talk and how you feel about each and every person in your life, that transfer into the videos and they can manipulate the edits, especially when they're there to experience what the hell you see and what the hell going on. A lot of people feel like, you know what I'm saying, they can send their editors videos across the country or whatever, yeah. you know, and yeah, I'm not saying that ain't wrong. That's, that's what I used to do too. You know what I, I ain't gonna lie, like in 2020, 19, 2020, after I had them, like stopped on my YouTube channel. I always edit for YouTube, but that's a big reason I had stopped. Cause mm -hmm. like it was like a, it wasn't. It it wasn't just, it, I went fucking with it, like the connection. Mm -hmm. You, know what you I'm gotta. Saying? That's why my editors. I feel like that's not. And he he can tell y'all, bro. I don't. I don't look at. I don't want to look at it like no business. I want you to be able to come around and not only edit but just do hella other shit. I want you to be in on my life and see who I'm actually fucking with, who I'm not fucking with or some change up in my life, I want you to understand because if my editor understands me best, then y'all can get the the feeling of how I feel through him because he know how to break it down and put it out there like, okay, boom, this is what really going on. Let me bring this out into the real world 
so people can feel where he coming from. I'm trying to go deep and reach people's souls so they can really feel me and feel like they there and, and understand. Let them know, let them know where your what the style of your videos headed. He making cinematic, cinematic man, cinematic. cinematic man. And you know what's crazy? I had a few editors and like the way I think and talk, people been telling me that oh, your editing style is cinematic. Oh, you like cinematic. Oh, you like cinematic. But he. You know, cause he more advanced and he know a whole lot more than I know. He, he like told me. Like sound design. Like song, what Look, you mean, bro. What you mean by cinematic? Y'all see this? Y'all see the sound design, bro? Y'all hit on sounds? It's off. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna show y'all too much yeah. yet, but y'all see the sound, bro. We taking this junk up a notch, man. I don't can't rhyme music. It's a blessing, man. man. I manifest to him. Um, I, I can't rhyme. I'm useful. I'm an asset here. Mm -hmm. Asset to me and. Bro. I've been waiting on the day to come provide. Bro, yeah, we finna go up. up. Like, I ain't even on cap. Like, <laughs> we finna go take up. Nice, like, man. when y'all see these videos coming out on my main channel, I just want y'all to know that it's him. Like, I'm breaking it down and try to, like, put it into art form so I can give it out to the world. But he, like, he like the messenger. He translating it for me, for y'all to see. You get what I'm saying? Because, you know, I just feel like, I, if I if a nigga across the country or another state, I can't have that connection. They can't really feel how I'm feeling about so and so. If I can have him pull up on me, like he done pulled up on me when I was at a girl's spot filming, and he see the connection and chemistry and how me and her talking and what the hell going on. He see all the shit behind camera, so he like, oh, okay, this was really going on. Let me, you know what I mean? But what? if I'm being honest with y'all, I really still be minding my business. You see I what I'm saying? Be, I I mind yeah, my nah, business. but I, I ain't no cap. I be wanting you around. You can, so you can see what's going on. So you can see how I feel about these folks. Whereas my editor, my other editors in the past, I can send them videos and tell them how I feel about somebody, but you still not gonna really understand because I'm telling you. Whereas in person, you see what's going on. You like, oh, I was right there when that shit had happened. I, I can break this shit down. I yeah. might have a creative idea yeah. to make sure people know, oh, no, it went this way. Yeah. You know, instead of like, you know, a lot of shit get watered down or a lot of stuff get exaggerated. You know, but I want to keep it how it was and as is. You feel me? I'm trying to go deep. I'm trying to go deep with this YouTube shit. Like, we're not making YouTube videos. We're making movies. Y'all see the sound design. Y'all see the sound design. This ain't nothing to play with, man. Look, look at the audios. He got audio one, audio two, audio three, audio four, audio five. Keep going. Look how many audio sound layers. He has 11 sound layers for a video, a movie. Man. This ain't nothing to play with. I just had to pick up the camera and say that, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you need to tell them, tell them your Instagram. My, Insta my name on everything is Dope Got Fame. D X P E Got Fame, man. Cause I'm going up too. You feel me? my YouTube still gonna go up too? But like, like I told him on this journey, on like my last YouTube journey three years ago when I was going up on YouTube. Like I want to do it with people this time. Like mm -hmm. I want to do it like with a group. You feel me? Cause mm -hmm. I was, I was like. The lone wolf. I ain't wanna. I ain't really wanna work with nobody. I would do everything on my own. I was mm -hmm. growing, but like you can grow more when you do shit with people, man. That's what mm -hmm. I wanted to do. And I'm yeah. glad, like I'm a social person. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not as social as I was in 2020. But because I was so social, and when I knew A, like you know, everybody know I know A B before everybody in 99. And me and him used to pop out every day and go film. But because I was the social one. I would be the one to extend my hand, like, oh, come, come film with us, come ride with us. What y'all doing? Come, come, let come film with us. Not knowing, me reaching my hand out and grabbing other motherfuckers in, they telling me about their YouTube journey and shit that they learned through YouTube, and I can add what they learned and what they experienced to my game. Like other YouTube, I'm like, okay, boom, he told me this is how I make my videos go green, so let me do this. Oh, he told me don't do that in my videos because they don't do that. Oh, he told me don't premiere my videos because it's going to take away from every little thing that I learned from these other YouTubers I put into my game. And it, 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 shortens, the, it shortens the time that I, I would have to learn it on my own if I was doing this all on my own. I, I get the information now, like, as they learning. They, they, whatever they learning, they come back to me and I'm learning, I'm putting it in my brain. Whereas I can go out in the world and do this on my own and figure out everything on my own, but it's gonna take a little bit longer, which nothing's wrong with that, but I'm trying, I'm trying to get to where I wanna go a little bit faster. I, I got, you know what I mean? I, I wanna learn as much as I can. I know everybody around me got something to tell me and something that I can learn from him. My other, every, every person around me, I can learn from them. 
And that's how I feel like everybody should surround themselves. If you can't learn something from exactly. whoever you're around, I don't, exactly. I don't know if it's the like, best when I was When I was at home, I was sitting on my bed. Like, I, bro, I haven't stressed this enough to the fact that I manifested this shit. Yeah. I was sitting on my bed. I was looking at 99. I, everybody 99 next video. I was like, I know I can provide value to them. Bro. I know I can provide value, bro. Yeah. And that shit, I made this shit happen, bro. You I did. made it happen, bro. You did. Oh, and man. you don't even know, bro. Like, this shit finna be crazy. Because I never, I never had two editors at, well, I had two editors at one time, but it wasn't for a long time. This is the longest I had two editors. If I, as long as I ever had Twitter, I think probably like three days. Dead ass, three days. The nigga said some. He said something like, I don't know. His his work schedule was too busy, school and all that, so it wasn't Man, gonna work out. I'm gonna tell you right now, I ain't, bro, I ain't, I ain't fucking with this y'all. I ain't yeah. mess with this y'all. So I ain't gonna let that get in front of them. Yeah. I'm gonna, I ain't even gonna be that for long, man. I'm yeah. mess with that. I'm a, I'm a future millionaire. I'm yeah. A, I'm a legendary and that's how you got to be. Like, exactly. I ain't exactly. Make nobody up company rich for that long, man. You hear me? I'm crazy, man. You hear me? You, you know what I'm bro. Follow your dreams, kid. We get one life. We get one life. Once you realize you get one life, and everybody, family members, friends, grandparents, none of their opinions matter. Once you figure out that nobody judgment or opinion, how they look at you and view you matters. Then you gonna you gonna follow your dreams like unapologetically and and not care what anybody think and you are gonna pursue them with all the energy you need. Imagine giving your dreams all the energy it needs. Like from the time you wake up and go to sleep every day, that's what you think and breathe. There's no way you cannot be successful. And I don't care how long you've been doing it. You are gonna be successful in it at some point. You you gonna be successful in it at some point. That's just how it works. If you think about something and you believe it and you write it and you speak it out there for so long, it has to come to you at some point. Yeah, so the piece is going to come. Power of manifestation, man. Law of attraction, man. Y'all better stop playing, man. And I don't even speak on that enough Please. on here, but that's that changed my life. When I found about law of attraction and, you know, how to make things come true in manifestation in middle school, that shit changed my life forever. It's all right. I'm gonna make a whole sit down video with 99 Nation. Forever. I know him and Avery into that and they need to well, talk what? about it more because I know I'm what? into it and I use the, the new people okay. I'm at with them. So, like, I'm gonna make that happen. Damn, you, where your phone at? I'm gonna, um, I wanna, um, call Avery and, but I want you to record so I can get it on camera. Like, with your phone, you can airdrop it to me for the vlog. What, what you wanna record? Yeah, I'm gonna, what I'm doing right now with my phone. I want you to do it with your phone and then airdrop it because I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my phone to call Avery. You get what I'm saying? Alright. I'm gonna call Avery. I'm gonna use his camera to, to finish vlogging, but I'm you gonna call Avery. Like, Yo, I just changed my fit real quick. You know what I'm saying? Man, my boy finna pop out on AB, Bobo, Tay, and pop out somewhere else after that and go chill and catch a vibe. AB talking about a lounge or some shit. I was talking about bowling. But I don't know what you finna get into, but I do know my dog coming with me, bro. My, you coming with me, Sly. You coming with me, Sly. Y'all see it. It's your boy, Dope Got Fame, man. Don't play with my name, man. Stay your lane, man. Don't put no grade, man. Talk yeah, man. yeah, yeah. Pop it, Twig. Pop it. Go ahead, dip, though, y'all. I see y'all very soon. No kidding me. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? We left from AB Crib. You finna go to a line. Maybe see if we can get in. I've been on the water diet. All these babies coming to my crib, nigga. I'm excited. All these bitches talking all that shit to her. Keep quiet. Yeah, baby, just keep quiet. Keep quiet. You know. Ooh, I even got the food, y'all. I be looking good. What do you want to do with that? What you think? We should do it on. Y'all, I never had this. We eating. Just know we eating good. <laughs> We eat, we, all, we do always eat good though. We do always eat good, I ain't gonna lie. All right. So yeah, me and um, Ivy are about to eat and do like a mood bang. Really finna just be talking and vibing for the vlog channel. If you watching this, just know main channel videos are coming very, very soon. I'm trying to be super, super active on this channel. Um, I'm proud of myself, I ain't gonna lie. I'm super proud of myself. When Ivy come back down, we gonna start this up. So like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notifications. And 
welcome back to another vlog with your boy Elias ATL. I can't cap. What song that is? Nah, that song good. What song is this? Janae Aiko. What's the name? You know what I'm saying? That's tough. I love her music. I was gonna see if you. I was gonna see if you actually listen to her music, but it doesn't really seem like you. I do listen to some of her songs. I'm not like a heavy. You know, she's a spiritual person. Do you listen to her music? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. Stop the cap. <laughs> What's wrong? Name a song. From time to time, I think. Uh, I love her best album to me is I think the Sellout. That's her best album to me. I fuck with that heavy. I ain't gonna cap. Like, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. Just cap like I'm just oh. Let's do it. Ivy, open up the food. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get the. Okay, you already told him we had. Nah, I didn't tell him. I didn't okay, tell him. Okay, so today we're going to be eating Cuddle House. Mmm. I'm guessing this is a lion's because this is not what I ordered. Mmm, okay. Or all that is me, huh? Yeah, he just always got to eat some bones, y'all. Hey, I'm not no little guy. But anyways, mm. it's on him. Mmm. And then we have this. Mm, what the? Mm, chill out now. <laughs> mm. Hey, hey, don't be bad at me. You did it. I ain't do it. Uh huh. I ain't do it. You did it. Hold on. I ain't get grits. Yes, you did. Damn. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ain't mine. That one yours. Okay. Yeah. Cause, Cause I'm like, like this shit. Od. <laughs> okay. Then you asked me. Okay. Cause hold on. You said. Do you want a waffle? I mean, should I get a waffle or should I get a pancake? I told you a waffle. Why am I looking at a pancake? Did you get a pancake? No. I got so, a waffle. So, you I'm, asked me. You, you said. So, I'm guessing this is the part where I get finessed out my waffle. Yeah. I get, okay. I'm going to take the air. I'm a gentleman, though, y'all. I'm, no, I'm going to take the air. No, we can look back at that order right you can now. Have the, you can have the waffle. You it's, asked me. You said. It's no pressure. You Relax. Said, no, because I'm, I'm actually mad that you got that pancake. Did you order that pancake? I don't think so. I don't think I really ordered either yeah, one. Yeah, he asked me. He said. To be honest. He was like, what was ordering food? He was like, should I get one for or should I get a pancake? I said, you should get one for. Okay, like look. Me. <laughs> look, this is mine. Boom, boom. And all that is yours. This is yours. I don't, I don't, know. I don't want the pancake. I ain't gonna lie. This is enough for me right here. I mean, I probably want it later. So we can keep it around. I'll put it in the refrigerator for you. Put yeah, let's do that. The grits are pretty hot right now. I hope it got cheese in it because it does it not look like it got cheese. Y'all got cheese? Got oh, God. Because I'm going to need some cheese. Yeah, you want me to warm it up for you? Yeah. You can warm this one up a little bit, too. But yeah, y'all, we about to start our vlog. Oh, look at Sierra in the background, man. Sierra, what you got going on, man? You got to eat some waffles? Oh, Sierra got, hey, she ain't playing with us. She finna, okay. What is it, strawberry waffles? Mm. I ain't gonna lie, y'all, this house is pretty big. I keep saying that. But every time I get in the kitchen, it feels so much bigger because I don't see back here. So I don't really see this part. This house is big as hell. I can't lie. I, st I, I think I still, I know it's like a, a bottom floor or some shit like that. I still haven't even been down there yet. This house is big as hell. But yeah, um, once you heat up my food, we're going to start this vlog up. Y'all stay tuned. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Um, If you do have some questions for us for our next move back, excuse me. Feel free to hit me in my DMs and ask those questions. Yeah, see you soon. When you try me, bitch, I get out my top and I see red like my eyes bleed. I give a fuck about what you made. I made that times three. Snatch the scat three times before the cat. Like Dodge sign me. Dodge the shit, I'm popping shit. That's on and off my IG. Did a hundred plus shows and